Does the data show that the black divorce rate is actually high or low? This is part three in the series, Leave Black People Alone, Men's Rights Movement Doesn't Apply to Black Men. One of the chief premises of the men's rights movement is that women have more rights in the courtroom during divorce. If I can prove to you that it doesn't apply to black men, then you should be convinced that the men's right movement does not apply to black men or black people in general. Hi, and welcome to the Shikama Live Show. Today's topic is the divorce rate amongst black people, specifically black men. If you look at the raw data, black people have a much lower divorce rate than white people. They are second only to Asians as far as divorce rate. Asians have the lowest and black people are right next to them. So if this is the case, then the entire notion that women have more rights in the courtroom and they get child custody and they uh, get child support and alimony more than men falls fat, flat on its face when you actually look at the data. And the data does show that I'm right. That is the census data and the Pew Research. When you get up to middle class and upper class, upper middle class levels of, of black people, which is the majority of the black population, you see that divorce rate is very low and marriage rate is actually very high. I already talked about marriage rate in the previous video, part two. This is the divorce rate. So the divorce rate amongst the black population is actually quite low. And historically, it has always been low, and the marriage rate has always historically been high amongst black people. Economically speaking, a black man and woman do far better when they get married and stay married. When you in increase an educational level, the marriage rates in increase and the divorce rates decrease. So, there is no question about alimony, child support, child custody amongst black people because we do not get divorced like white people get divorced. In fact, the data actually shows that the divorce rates are quite exaggerated in the, in the media, in the movies and entertainment industry. They want to put forth this notion, notion that people get divorced and married less, divorce more and married less. The reality is your own numbers for white people are wrong too. You need to go check that out. I'm not going to say uh, that there is a conspiracy for the men's rights movement or the feminist movement for that matter, but for black people it doesn't apply. As far as the divorce rate is concerned and the notion that women have more rights, it doesn't apply because we don't go to divorce court as often. Check you later. Thank you for watching the Shikama Live Show.